Hello, my beautiful Virgo friends. How are you? Welcome back to Sacred Knowledge Tarot. I am so happy and thankful to each and every one of you for being here with me today. So thank you, everyone. I'm going to pull three cards out of my tarot deck to see what message Spirit has for you. And at the end of this reading, Virgo, I'm going to pull an additional bonus card, including an angel number for you as well. So stay tuned for that, my friends. All right, we are starting here with the Queen of Pentacles. Look at this beautiful card here, Virgos. This is a place that you want to be in. This is a place that you are headed, a place of abundance, a place of luxury, a place of everything that you ever wanted. And this is really you creating this for yourself and growing within it. And boy, oh boy, are you going to see some growth here, my friends. So get ready for this powerful energy to take over your lives here. Okay, and the Temperance card, this is all about about balance this is all about harmony in your life I feel for some of you maybe you're living through some chaos right now maybe there's some instability but whatever is going on know that balance and security and stability is coming into your lives so look at this powerful powerful energy and I feel let me just pull some more cards a lover's card as well so look at this I feel for some of you you're going to have a choice to make and love is coming in as well and this choice that you're going to have to make it has to do with following your heart and really walking down the path that you are passionate about that you choose here virgos okay so these are two major arcana cards that you have so i feel for some of you you're feeling this breeze of change coming into your life here and with this spread i feel there is going to be some mass massive changes for the better here okay so let's look at this uh, queen of pentacles this is a place of abundance this is where you have everything here and it's you really creating this place for yourself so you have to really envision and have clarity around what it is that you want in your material world here on earth virgos and really focusing in on not only shifting your mindset but putting yourself into a place or into this uh, energy or vibration of abundance and that's going to come through you really tapping into your inner power uh, that inner love that you express outwardly into everything that you do as you move forward and this is all about self-regulation as well this is going to be huge here that temperance that balance that harmony okay and creating the success I'm seeing financial stability and freedom here for some of you Virgos and I do feel here you've been seeing signs from the universe whether it's a peacock you've seen recently through a picture or actually a live peacock in person or some sort of other sign from spirit guides and the universe here and you know it's gonna start off with a little opportunity that's gonna come your way here Virgos and you actually picking it up and running with it this could be in the form of a loan some sort of financial support through some some way in your life or this is you really investing in yourself by learning and taking in knowledge which is in turn going to enhance your skill sets which is going to help you grow whatever this is know that it is coming and it's going to grow into this abundant place and you know this may start off as as you buying a new home moving to a different place there's a different energy that is kind of coming through here for you Virgos and some of you are feeling this breeze of change coming through so with this energy I do feel for some of you that there is a big decision that you have to make around this to bring yourself to this place or to this energy and I do feel that some of you Virgos are feeling that ascension happening this can feel a little bit uncomfortable you're feeling some of you're going to feel some headaches or just not feeling good it almost feels like a cold for some of us right and this is um, that feeling like okay there's something not right there's something about to change here and you're feeling that shift within yourself and around your environment okay this sometimes can come in as um, not as a tower moment but a moment but more of a ten of swords feeling where you're almost feeling weighed down and you're you're knowing that there needs to be some sort of a change in your life and it's gonna be you know this realization of having to create that place for yourself that inner knowing that okay it's time for me to really take charge of my life and create that life that I desire and I feel that a lot of you are going to uh, feel this fire igniting inside yourselves that is going to unleash this version of yourself that is going to get to work here that's going to start hustling 
And as this energy is coming through here for you, Virgos, I feel that you are going to embark on something, this little opportunity, this pinnacle that is coming in that has arrived or is in your mind, in the back burner, in the background that is going to come to the surface and you're really going to pick up on it and start moving forward with it, whatever this is for you. Okay, I feel some of you are going to start a new project, maybe start a new job, maybe you're going to move somewhere, which in turn is going to amplify that uh, inner energy to really do something different. Okay, lots of different things that can happen here, but I feel there's going to be a lot of growth in your abundance, in your finances, in your material world. Lots of things are going to start changing for you. And as you're going through this, it's going to require you to really uh, bring balance into your life, really take care of your temple and everything that you are consuming and bringing into your life. And also practicing uh, meditation to self-regulate and ground yourselves, okay? And the self-regulation is all about um, you really coming to your present moment and realizing uh, where you are in your current life right now and how things, you know, being aware and looking around and, and being grateful for everything that you currently have and recognizing the things that need to change in your life in order to create this balance. I feel for some of you, this is going to be a major lifestyle change. This is where you are really, um, taking care of your body, your temple, and also taking care of your mind and what you're kind of consuming in both, like what you're taking in with your um, mind, your eyes, and what you're taking in as far as your body, like what you're eating. So this is uh, you really shifting uh, your diet. This is you taking care of your body by exercising. This is you really putting love toward yourself, which is going to then show outwardly. Okay, and I feel here as you're bringing balance, into your life Virgos that people are going to start noticing something different about you and maybe perhaps some some people are already approaching you and letting you know that there's something different about you here Virgo what is it that you're doing because you're starting to shine okay so I feel this is coming through as well and taking things into moderation and really being patient with yourself and patient through this process of growth because this is going to take time it doesn't come over month overnight this is a process that you have to go through there's a building that is happening here there's a creation and that creating process that creation process does take time so you're going to have to practice patience here it's going to come through but know that as this abundance trickles in it's going to help motivate motivate you a little bit more as you're seeing the result of your hard work and all the changes that you are implementing in your lives here. And, you know, I feel this is a big choice for some of you in that you are facing this choice right now and you have a decision to make around this here, um, Virgos. And, this is almost like a, a, a crossroads that some of you are at right now. And it's a matter of you either walking down the same path that you're walking down and remaining in that same cycle, that same loop that you have been experiencing, some of you, not all of you, right? And there's a new path that has opened up. And this path is what is leading you to this place of the Queen of Pentacles. And, you know, this could be in the form of you now deciding that, okay, I want to start doing something I enjoy doing. There's something that you uh, are naturally talented with and you want to explore this a little bit more and tap into that and see if you can create a biz business around this because the queen of pentacles i truly feel here virgos this is someone that is self-made this is someone that has brought themselves to this place this is someone that has taken the initiative to learn things and understand what it is that they need and require in their life to get ahead and i feel this is the the, the, the decision or choice that you're having to make where you're realizing and understanding Understanding this okay and I feel as as well for some of you that are single out there Virgos that along this path is a soulmate that is ready to come into your life and you are going through this process of change a major transformation of not only bringing balance into your life and harmony but you as a person are changing and aligning to that path that you're meant to walk down and to meet this person so those of you that are trying to manifest a soulmate into your life, it's time to really write down a list of what it is that you are seeking in a partner and manifest that into your reality as you're going through this process of growth and enhancement, okay? And really following the path that truly resonates with you, with your heart, with your higher self. 
All right. I feel for some of you, you are in a place right now where maybe you're not feeling content or satisfied. And that breeze of change has come through to, through into your life and you're starting to think about things a little bit more on a deeper level. Like, okay, so I'm at this place in my life right now. I'm not getting any younger. It's time to really think seriously about what it is that I want and where I want my life to kind of lead to. And for some of you, maybe retirement is kind of in the picture. That's what I'm thinking about, right? I'm in my mid-40s now, and I have to think about my retirement, my future, right? And for some of you, I feel you are looking at that long-term view, and you're really thinking about your present life right now and how you feel in that present life and the things that you need to do in order to change them, whether you're going to remain on the course that you're on or if you're going to shift paths. And this, this shifting of paths is truly about you doing what you desire, something that you have been wanting to do for a very long time here, Virgos. And for others, this is you making little bits of adjustments to come to this place of true happiness and abundance. Okay, and that soulmate that's coming in for some of you, this person is going to enter it with a powerful impact in your life here. I'm feeling this like powerful energy here where, um, as you're going through this change, as you're getting into motion, you're going to bump into whoever this is. And this person isn't coming in to save you here, Virgos. This is somebody that is going to be an equal partnership that is going to have a positive impact on your life. And this is where that abundance is going to come in because the Queen of Pentacles can't do it alone. Even though you can be self-made and be alone in this, but you're going to amplify and double that energy with a king here, my friends. So that's the missing piece here. That's the missing link for some of you, not everyone. And know that you don't have to have a secondary person in order to bring you wealth and abundance. Okay, you can do this alone as well. But those of you that are wanting a partner know that this soulmate is going to come in and amplify things a little bit more here. So get ready for this energy. I feel this is a powerhouse. This is a major change. And get ready for this. I feel you need to hold on tight because your life is about to change in a big way here, Virgos. All right, I'm now going to pull that bonus card for you, Virgo. This is a uh, deck that I have. It's called the Priestess of Light Oracle. So I'm going to read the interpretation from the guidebook for you for this card that I pull. I just find these interpretations to be absolutely beautiful and thorough. Okay, so let's see what we get here for you today. All right, River of Blessings, Releasing Constraints. Virgos, look at this beautiful, stunning, and abundant card. I feel there are some major blessings coming in. Everything that is happening, this change is even a blessing in disguise for you. So let me read this to you here, number 47. Rivers of Blessings. The Priestess of Purification holds out a bowl of blessed water, overflowing in your direction here, Virgos. The all-seeing jaguar brings his power of creation into your life, heralding a significant positive change in your circumstances. You may have been experiencing a time of challenges such as financial constraints, perhaps living paycheck to paycheck, or going deep into debt, okay? Um, let's see. Your restrictions, however, may be of a more emotional nature. Perhaps you've been lonely, missing romantic... Sorry. Perhaps you've been lonely, missing romantic, familial, or friendly love. Even a lack of joy from the ongoing tediousness of life could be a great limitation for some of you. But whether these restrictions have been long-lasting or recent, this card reveals a new powerful force flowing to your life, breaking through even severe limitations of the past, Virgos. Your difficulties may have been very hard to bear, but this has been a time of profound purification for you. The Priestess of Blessings uh, the priestess is blessing your rebirth after suffering, giving you the jaguar's ability to view your experience with sharp-eyed clarity, a release of attachment that brings the promise of achievement. Whatever limitations you have endured, a beneficial solution is coming your way, Virgos. So rest assured that the old issues will be resolved. As you go through your day, bless yourself with a clear intention. See any restrictions as merely a part of your passage from purification to personal progress. 
Just as a jaguar has a unique visual acuity, acuity, your own inner visions are coming into sharp focus, ready to become an even greater reality. In fact, this river, the river of blessings will carry you far beyond anything you have yet imagined, Virgos. So embrace this energy here, my friends. Tap into what it is that's coming your way. Make that choice based out of your heart chakra, based on what it is that you desire here, my friends. All right. I'm now going to pull an angel number for you, an angel card, and see if some of you have been seeing angel numbers. This is going to be your confirmation, and for others, you can use this as an affirmation. All right, so let's see what we get here for you. Right, let's put that there and see. Number 44, I am supported. Virgos, you, my friends, are supported. So let me read this to you. If you've been seeing four fours everywhere, fours, this is your confirmation. Your angels are encouraging you to continue on, on your present life path with diligence and determination and even greater success will come in the future. So look at that. All right, so that is your message. You are supported no matter what it is that you do here, my friends. Whether you want to make that choice to keep walking down the path that you're currently walking down and grow within that and see success around that, or whether you're wanting to pivot. All right, know that you are going to be supported no matter what. All right, so that is your reading, my friends. I hope it resonates for you. If it does, please comment below, hit that like button. And if you're brand new to my channel and you're enjoying my content, please consider subscribing. Other than that, I wanted to wish you all a beautiful day and thank you so much for watching.